Hello! We begin with the classic cotton pads and latex. We cover up her eye to create the missing eye effect. We continue to dip cotton in the latex and build a hollowed out effect. We spread the cotton out, downwards, and go around the mouth as well. The cotton helps to create a fleshy skin texture. We use acrylic nail tips for teeth, and uh, since we put the teeth on her lips, it's great if the fake teeth bend inwards, like these do. We need to secure the teeth, so we cut out uh, small strips from our cotton pad and place over the teeth edge. Add an extra layer of latex and then we go on. Next up, creating an edge for the wound and we're gonna use Sculpt Gel. If you don't have access to Sculpt Gel, you can use paper and latex, cotton pads and latex, maybe wax even, so take what you have. Ellie's putting on a lot of Sculpt Gel to, uh, to be able to create hanging loose skin. And that's what you see here, ripped up skin. Or it will be, in a while. A little clean up and then we head on to colors and foundation. We go around the wound, covering up only on the outside. Then add a little extra nose piece here. One round of powder, and then we head on to the colors. Starting off with black in the hollowed out eye, mix it up with a little red, and then we fill the whole uh, wound area with the red color. Ellie is creating sort of a natural wound look here, but you can go zombie on this makeup as well. Just change up the colors a little, and you have a full on zombie. Then Ellie slaps on a lot of blood here. And after that, we continue to enhance the bruising and uh, wound effect on the edge. So we use a darker shade of tone around the whole wound and then go on with the sponge. Using red color as well as fake blood. Fake blood in Swedish. Lossas blod. Now we need to create some muscle fibers and we use cotton dipped in fake blood to create that. And you can shape it any way you want when you apply it. And we outline the wound with a little blood. Then continue with another great effect. Pieces of glass in the wound. Ellie's using real movie FX breakaway glass, but you can use uh, pieces of a bottle or something like that. Just cut out some transparent material and uh, use latex to glue it in the wound. And there you go, your car crash victim. Thank you so much for your support and uh, please share this if you like it.